Look, our expectations heading into reporting season are that the outlook for 14 is going to be very cautious. So what we've seen from a lot of companies that we've been speaking to in the last three months is that revenue growth uh, is very hard to come by. Um, and a lot of the earnings growth is actually coming from cost, cost cutting. And we expect that to continue in the outlooks for companies in 14. Now, just to give you an example, the market consensus forecast for EPS growth for 14 is 11.5% for all companies that are listed. We think that's, um, that could be at the upper end of uh, what expectations will be rebased to after reporting season. So what, we've, what we are seeing is that the broader economy is slowing. So mining investment has peaked. The non-mining economy is picking up some of the slack. Uh, however, it's not strong enough to actually pick up all the, the fall off in growth in mining investment. And what that means is we might head into a bit of a soft patch for the economy. And so there will be particular sectors that will be affected. So we expect you know, cautious outlook from the retailers, um, also coming into an election, um, that, that they're going to be cautious. Uh, cautious outlook from some of the builders, even though interest rates are low. Activity levels are picking up, but they're not, you know, they're not really off to the races just yet. Um, mining companies uh, will deliver strong results, but again, it's about the outlook. What is China doing? And we think that China will slow, and that will mean commodity prices will be lower. The banks will deliver robust results, uh, growth of around 5%. But the issue for the banks is, if we do get a soft patch in the economy, rising unemployment, what that means for credit quality and what that means for earnings moving forward. Um, so they're, they're the key things that we think will happen. We think the outlook is going to be tough and cautious from a lot of companies um, and that moving forward uh, we see that there will be signs of pickup. Well, we are looking for signs of pickup after the election. So key will be consumer confidence after the election and also what business are thinking and whether they're going to start investing. And there are our key thoughts.